but we feel like in their current format, the Warren Mees are not of much use to anybody. Warn Me is UC Berkeley's brand name for warning notifications sent to the Cal community when an incident occurs that poses an immediate threat to the health and safety of the campus community. According to UC Berkeley's Cleary Coordinator and Director of Cleary Compliance, Abigail Ogden, most Warn Me messages are required by the Cleary Act, a federal statute that requires colleges and universities to keep and disclose information about crime on and near their respective campuses. Here's how Warn Me works according to Ogden. Phase one, an incident occurs. The life of a warn me starts when a significant emergency or dangerous situation, such as a robbery, a gas leak, an armed intruder, or civil unrest, occurs within the geographic area specified under the Clary Act. Phase 2. UCPD is notified of the situation. Once UCPD is aware of the incident, the UCPD patrol sergeant on duty is responsible for sending the initial emergency notification in a timely manner to all students and employees. Phase 3. The UCPD dispatcher drafts the warn me. The university has a wide range of message templates addressing several different situations. The UCPD individual authorizing the alert will modify the template to address the specifics of the present incident or develop a new one for unprecedented cases where there is no predetermined template. As for what's included in a warn me, the on-duty patrol surgeon determines what incident details are necessary and appropriate to promote safety and help prevent similar crimes. Phase 4. The Warn Me is sent out to the Cal community. Per the Warn Me website, by default, all UC Berkeley email addresses are automatically enrolled in UC Berkeley Warn Me. These emails are sent using the Everbridge Mass Notification System. But although these Warn Me's are immediately sent as emails, people can also manually register to receive these notifications as texts instead. Phase 5. The warn me situation is demoted to non-threatening. Once those within UCPD assess that a situation no longer poses an active threat to the Cal community, a warn me is considered a closed case. Throughout this process, warn me is self-advertised as just one part of the warning system employed to keep campus safe. But do students actually find warn me's helpful? Um, I personally don't. Some of them I just ignore. Um, I do kind of. They do flood my email quite a bit, as they do everyone's. Honestly, they kind of make me anxious about the campus in general. It's a lot to throw on students. The students' complaints about Warn Me's being unhelpful are best summarized by Sagar Jatani, the president and co-founder of Safe Bears, a nonprofit started by a group of parents who are dedicated to raising awareness about the safety situation around campus and encouraging admin and UCPD to do more. Well, boiling it down, there are three big uh, issues that we see with the Warm Me system, three things about it that need to be improved upon. Uh, they don't cover the true scope of dangerous incidents that are taking place. Two, they're sent out too late to really be of use to folks. And three, they don't contain enough specific information to help people avoid going into harm's way. As we've talked to many students who they just don't feel safe. If you look at what they're talking to uh, the media about, what they're telling the Daily Cal, what they're saying on Reddit, it all comports. It all forms part of a cohesive picture. Crime at Cal is really bad. Fixing the Warmy system by itself doesn't, doesn't really solve that problem. But while we pursue bigger, hopefully more uh, systemic fixes to the causes, the root causes of crime in Berkeley, the Warmies need to follow suit. They need to be improved so that while the crime is still happening, the Warmies are at least useful enough so that they can take reasonable steps to keep themselves safe. Reporting for Cal TV News, this is Bella Lou. I'll see you guys next time.